Sneaker culture, a phenomenon that first took off in the 1980s with the release of the Air Jordan line, has seen exponential growth in recent years. From A-list celebrities to the average consumer, sneakers have become a symbol of self-expression. We traveled to Atlanta recently where a new program is helping students get their foot in the door of this lucrative market. America's sneaker obsession is now an $80 billion industry. From sportswear to street style, sneakers have evolved into cultural commodities. But there are few opportunities to learn the ins and outs of sneaker making. The Savannah College of Art and Design, known as SCAD, has developed a program to do just that, a sneaker design minor, the first of its kind in the U.S. Roderick Thomas is a senior at SCAD's Atlanta campus. What's it take to get a minor in sneaker design from SCAD? A passion. <laughs> you have to want to do this. Thomas created this hiking shoe last semester. Protect from trees and rocks. And says the design process is part research, part intuition. It's like you kind of know like when you get the shoe that you like, it's like, mm -hmm. all right, this is the one right here. SCAD piloted the program last spring, offering courses on sketching, rendering, and even designing with virtual reality technology. All skills that SCAD's president, Paula Wallace, says are essential for industry newcomers. SCAD's sneaker design program really epitomizes the university's mission to prepare students for creative professions. To stay competitive, brands need brilliant ideas executed with chic and sustainable design. You want a career designing kicks? You got it. Lauren Amos, a SCAD alum, launched Wish ATL, a streetwear boutique, nearly 20 years ago. Now she's funding a scholarship to support students in the sneaker design program. This just, I mean, it hit all the right buttons. To be able to help in any capacity and for there to be more diversity within the sneaker community is really important to me. SCAD alumni have landed jobs with major shoe brands, Nike, Adidas, Reebok, and New Balance. Give him some pop. Mm -hmm. And one alum is bringing what he's learned back to his alma mater. When I got word that SCAD was launching his first accredited sneaker monitor here and they wanted somebody to delete it, they reached out and I automatically knew that, oh yeah, I'm definitely coming back because it's a passion of mine that I want to, you know, give that energy to the new students, the new generation of designers. Quinton Williams co-founded Q4, a footwear company that partners with professional athletes. When you're reviewing your students' designs, how do you separate the good from the great? The easy answer to separate a good design from a bad design is the reason why. Hmm. Why did you design it? that way what was the reason and if you don't have an answer it's not good design good design has purpose good design has functionality and it makes the user experience better so that's what we try to preach here i didn't think it was going to be like that for students like thomas mastering the why in sneaker design is only part of the program's appeal it's also the mentorship from successful designers like williams he isn't sure he could find anywhere else I didn't see a lot of people who look like me doing it. And I was like, okay, he's successful. He went to SCAD. I had to make it happen. SCAD hopes the program will create a pipeline for a new generation to continue making strides in an industry that isn't slowing down anytime soon.